Welcome to our Hotel Tips channel. This is Fernandez speaking, and today I'm going to talk about what to do in Tampa, Florida, a city that neighbors Orlando and is famous for being home to the Busch Gardens Park. Although count on many other unmissable attractions and a great hotel chain. But first, enjoy this video. Subscribe to our channel and turn on notifications so you don't miss any news here. Check out the links to hotels, car rental, and much more in the video description. So now I'm going to talk about the places you can't miss visit in Tampa. And the first tip on what to do in Tampa, and without a doubt the most popular, is to go to Busch Gardens in Tampa, the best amusement park in Florida for those looking for the thrill of roller coasters at great value for money, compared to the parks in Orlando. Tickets here are cheaper, the lines are shorter and the roller coasters are incredible. If you like more extreme roller coasters, be sure to go on these. Iron Gwazi is the newest roller coaster at Busch Gardens. 91 drop and loops in a hybrid wood and iron structure guarantee the thrill. Cheetah Hunt Inspired by the speed of the cheetah, Cheetah Hunt's focus is on smooth, fast turns to convey the sensation of being in a high-speed chase. To achieve this, you are launched three times along the way. Montu Inverted Roller Coaster When your feet are free to swing in the wind, with lots of spins and inversions. Shikra The initial drop of more than 60 meters is very impressive. Finally, the park has many attractions for those who don't want that much excitement, from more traditional rides to ice skating shows. Ybor City is Tampa's Latino district and was the epicenter of the heyday of the cigar industry in the United States. Today, it is a neighborhood with a vibrant cultural scene that encompasses diverse gastronomic options, nightclubs, artistic workshops, and microbreweries. In fact, the neighborhood's gastronomic renaissance happened largely thanks to the emergence of these breweries, which were attracted by the region's low real estate costs a few years ago. After it was consolidated, the public began to look for more and better gastronomic options nearby, which boosted the snack bar and restaurant business in the neighborhood. Be sure to include Ybor City on your list of things to do in Tampa. Whether for a simple walk around the neighborhood in search of unexpected finds, or to discover its main attractions, such as the Columbia Restaurant and one of its breweries. The tour of the J.C. Newman Cigar Factory is one of the coolest tour when choosing what to do in Tampa. Cigar production was the city's main economic activity in the early 20th century, when more than 150 factories were in operation. This even earned Tampa the nickname Cigar City, the J.C. Newman Building was built in 1910, and fans of old machinery and factory tour will be pleased to know that there are relics from that era on display, as well as almost century-old equipment still in use. The tour is very informative and goes through all stages of production, from the treatment of tobacco leaves to the manual process of rolling cigars. The aquarium complex is gigantic and has more than 20,000 animals and thousands of aquatic plants native to the state of Florida and other parts of the world. The Florida Aquarium is located in Tampa Bay near the Tampa Bay History Center, Glacier Children's Museum, American Victory Ship and Channel Side Bay Plaza. The attraction opened in March 1995 and is now one of the largest aquariums in the world, receiving thousands of tourists every year. The place has attractions for children and adults, from swimming with sharks to educational classes about marine life and environmental preservation. And the last tip for today is, watch an American football game. Don't miss an NFL game in Tampa, the National American Football League. The matches are real attractions and take place at the Raymond James Stadium, located in the city's famous Busch Gardens Park. Many tourists like to watch the games during their trip to Orlando, as it is a unique and very fun experience. Don't miss an NFL game in Tampa, Orlando. And as an extra tip, don't forget to visit the wonderful beaches of Tampa Bay, which is known for having paradisiacal beaches and cultural attractions, as well as restaurants specializing in seafood and great nightlife in the neighborhoods surrounding the beaches. The coast is an unmissable attraction and has several beaches that are among the most beautiful in the United States, with excellent facilities for relaxing and enjoying. 
It is an option that should not be missing from your travel itinerary. The City Pass is a pass that gives access to various attractions in the city of Tampa for a fixed price of 106 United States dollars for adults and 96 United States dollars for children. Just buy on the official City Pass website and enjoy this benefit. I hope you enjoyed today's tips. A big hug and see you next time.